What's going on everybody? It's Adam here with another video. Uh, wanted to talk to you about camping on the North Shore of Lake Superior. If you're thinking about it, if you're a newbie like I've been, uh, I've been camping around here now, touring around in my van for a uh, better part of a month and backcountry camping in uh, both Lake Superior Provincial Park and Puckasaw, which is where I currently am right now. I'd go stand up there, but the wind is really bad. Um, anyways, I just thought I'd give you like three pointers. Uh, three pointers you need to know before you come backcountry camp at Lake Superior, okay? <laughs> Ones that I wish I knew. Um, first one is it's cold. Like, not just the water. Everyone knows you can't really swim in Lake Superior. Like, if you're planning on swimming in Lake Superior, I hope you're, you know, Wim Hof, that cold training guru guy. Um, it's freezing. But that's not necessarily what I what I mean. Uh, what I mean is the actual air, like the weather is colder. Picture like you're in your living room and you got a big old bathtub full of ice and a big fan behind the ice blowing straight at you. Like the lake is freezing. There's always a breeze coming off the water right at you onto land. And you're gonna feel that cold breeze. Like I've had a toque on most nights uh, and this is end of July. This is the height of summer. So, um, it's cold up here. If you're gonna go backcountry camping up this way, make sure you bring your cold weather stuff. <laughs> make sure you bring good, oops, going through a dark patch here. Make sure you bring your uh, like toque, some gloves, sweater, warm pants, long johns even if you want. So make sure you bring your warm stuff. Um, next is bugs. Uh, it's like I say, uh, July 24th or something right now. It's like the height of summertime uh, In most places the bugs kind of taper off when I say most places most people in uh, Well, I guess I'm speaking from southern Ontario Algonquin Park somebody who's been there a lot uh, People from you know that that aren't used to bugs aren't used to camping and are used to like more southern parks uh, or natural areas the bugs are brutal in July here I've been swarmed every day, uh, like, you know, head to toe at certain points of the day. So um, be prepared for that. August is probably a bit better, um, but July is like, you know, July 24th. And they told me when I got here, it's the height of bug season and they were right. Um, and it's hard because, you know, you're hiking in July, you're hot um, in the woods, you get the sun's beating down on you and you stop to rest and you immediately get swarmed, right? So be prepared for that. A lot of bugs in the middle of July when you'd think they'd be gone. <laughs> um, and number three, Superior is the master around here. <laughs> uh, if it wants to be foggy for three days, it's gonna be foggy for three days. Um, when you get really hot days, which there are really hot days, there's always a cool breeze though, it seems. Um, but either way, if you get a really hot day, that hot air mixing with the really cold water on the lake makes for a super foggy day or a super foggy couple of days where you, like, you can't see anything. It's like, you're, it's like the Atlantic Ocean, uh, light, diet Atlantic Ocean. I've lived by the Atlantic Ocean, it's the same thing. It is in charge, you have no control. You're best to just submit to the lake <laughs> because um, the weather can change like that and be prepared for fog and cold. Um, so it's all the extremes going on up here, but is it ever beautiful? Um, some of the most beautiful untouched landscapes you could ever hope to see. I'm just at a random campsite right now that's not being used off the trail and I mean, uh, the water is super clear and you know, there's a sand beach right here, check this out. A little one but there's a lot more that came from so just thought I'd make a quick video if you're thinking of checking out Lake Superior just know those three things dress for the cold be prepared for bugs and be prepared for some crazy weather including a lot of fog all right everyone happy trails <laughs> <laughs>